Yes, so this piece behind us is a collaboration between three artists. So Patrick Amber created the sculpture for us. Nicholas Lewis did the audio that you can hear in the background. And I created all the visuals. And it's based on a project I did with Rao Street in the middle of lockdown called Quarantine Creates, which was a citizen journalist project. So it's really about kind of what, what were the real positives out of the pandemic? And, and the main thread was that community so everybody kind of reconnected with their communities so when we were looking at kind of creating a, a, a community light installation I did some research and was looking at the murmurations in Doncaster and thought that's a really good visual example of when a community works really well when it moves together and it collaborates together so um, we've built this starling and then I've created lots of kind of visuals that mimic murmuration so they're all geometric shapes and then from there we worked with our composer who then created a sound score that's part original from the original score from Quarantine Creates and then a new score that involves murmurations and then music to reflect all of the um, the workings that made up the entire project. Music, very well thought, I have to say. Thank you very much. So can you tell us about the reaction, the public? Yeah, so um, so far we've had a really positive reaction. People really love it. Um, you know, they really want to talk about it. They're, people are sharing th their stories of the murmurations in Doncaster. People are also sharing their stories of, of kind of the positives for them about communities. When when we explain that kind of some of the, the ideas behind it, um, people just seem to be really kind of pleased to be out doing things and seeing things. So we've had a really positive response. So I'm really pleased. And it's for me, it's really, it's really great to make work in Doncaster and present it because um, I don't traditionally present that much work in Doncaster. So it's for me, it feels really special to be here doing it in my hometown.